Hey everyone. This week in House of Force, let's look at something that every development team uses on a day-to-day -day basis, which is version control. And I've got a great alternative, in fact the best alternative for uh you know, look if you look at uh, GitHub or GitLab or Bitbucket, best alternative to that is uh, Gitt, which is completely private, open source, which means you can take it and self force it on your own on your all you need is a server and you can run this. It is super lightweight and it is it's packed with features. It can you know double as a DevOps platform as well. So with one single application, you'll be able to host your code, you'll be able to set up CI CD pipelines and deploy your code. If you look at you know, GitHub, GitHub is all right with respect to pricing. They, they charge you know, $4 per user per month, which is fine. Uh, if you look at GitLab, they used to show their pricing here, which was very expensive. It was uh, $29 per user per month. This was their announcement in back in 2023 when they moved their pricing from $19 to $29 per user per month. It's one of the most expensive platform out there. Uh, there is also other alternatives to GitHub, GitLab, which is COGS. Cogs is good, but it is in a way uh, pretty uh, standard with its user interface. But if you look at Gitty, Gitty has great user interface. It is lightning fast. It is built on Go and is also used by uh, leading companies. Even they claim that even Google is using their platform. At Bellstones, uh, we self-host Gitty inside our virtual private network. So last week we looked at Netbird, which is again on my profile. So inside Netbird, we've self-hosted Kitty, where we use uh, Kitty as our Git platform and as our uh, CI CD pipeline. So if you look at their documentation, they've given you, you know, setup how to install and run it. You can either do it through this platform or you can directly, uh, in a few clicks, you can run it on through the House of Force platform where you just go search for Kitty and you launch it and it will run. Uh, in our setup, we've used Docker for our internal uses. Through House of Force, we've done it using uh, Kates, so it can scale up and down according to your requirements. So a few challenges that you might run into when you are self-hosting Gitty on your own uh, would be with, um, you know, SSH. So the SSH setup that we might use to push our code, pull our code. They even use ways to uh, connect it because it goes through the host machine, then through the Docker uh, container it needs to go in. So there are certain additional setups that needs to be done. Again, these are some of the technical challenges that you might run into if you are Know, self hosting these platforms on your own. So that's where we look. We at House of Force um, want to bridge that gap so that even uh, non technical teams or technical teams who don't want to handle um, you know, such things can leverage the House of Force platform where our team takes care of end to end setup, hosting, maintenance, and backups as well. Now, let me show you how you can. In minutes, have Gitty up and running for your own development teams and requirement. So you sign up to the uh, the House of Force platform, and once you sign up, you can create a workspace. And then inside workspaces, you can have multiple applications running. So I have a few applications running here. What you can do is you can go and create a new application. And here you see Gitty. You also have a, a variety of applications that you can choose from. Uh, so let me choose Gitty here, and continue. I go in and for you know, less than 25 monthly active users, it's going to cost you around $14. So if you calculate that, you know, let's say 14 divided by 25, well, it's less than a, a dollar per person. If you look at GitHub, even GitHub seems to be more expensive than that. So with this pricing, you can just uh, go and launch your application. And in a few minutes, the application will be up and running and we'll be able to give you a, a URL where you can go and have this application. For example, once you launch an application, We'll have this visit application URL, so you can click on that URL and go and view that application. So if I click here, it will take you to the, the ERP next application that I'm running for another demo. Uh, but that's how our platform works and you'll have the default administrator credentials and password through which you can log in and start using the application. So if this is something that you're interested in, uh, not only for Gitty, for any other applications that you'd like to uh, self-host and run, do reach out to us. We'll be happy to assist you in your open source journey. Just thank you.